Hey guys and welcome to Quick Tech Tips, a weekly series covering tips and tricks for a variety of devices. In this episode, I'll show you how to dim your iPhone display beyond what the general settings allow you to do. So let me show you how this is done. Now to show and use that controller, it's actually really simple. So first what we want to do is open up the settings application. And then we want to navigate to general settings and then to accessibility. And from here, let's open up the zoom menu. And we want to make sure zoom is on and show controller is on. When you press on show controller, a new option will be present and that is the visibility. So when you press on that, we have a couple options. We can make this controller more visible or less visible. I tend to make it less visible because it's less intrusive when I use my phone. So now let's close up all of these settings panes and go to our home screen. So now the obvious part is opening up that controller. So just tap on it one time. And then when that opens, we'll have another menu. It's kind of like a secret menu, which is kind of cool. So if it's looking a little funky and zoomed in, make sure that you are zoomed out so it looks as it normally would when you don't have the zoom turned on. So next what we want to do is we want to go to choose filter and press on that. And then a sub menu will appear and we want to go down to the low light option. So press on that one time and you'll see your phone has dimmed without you actually dimming it in the control center or in the settings app. So in conjunction with this cool little zoom control, we want to swipe up and we can bring up our control center. And we can also dim the screen with that low light setting applied. So you can make this screen really dim and that is especially helpful when it's nighttime and you don't want the screen blasting in your face. So if we want to undo this, we can open up this controller again and we can go to choose filter and we can turn off the low light. And if you're feeling fancy, you can show you can choose filters and you can go to grayscale inverted, grayscale or inverted. So I guess I forgot to turn off the low light. But if you're feeling fancy again, you can turn that on and your screen will look crazy. You can also make that grayscale and inverted, but it's totally up to you. I'm just going to leave that at none. So that's pretty cool how you can use that low light setting to dim your display without dimming it in your control center. So it just makes it a lot dimmer and a lot easier to use when it's darker outside. Alright, I hope this video helped you out and taught you something new as that is the goal of this new series. So if you like this content, please check out the other Quick Tech Tip videos and subscribe to see more of these. Thanks for watching again and I'll see you next Monday. Have a great rest of your day.